Hello everyone. In recent times, I have seen many crises going around the internet which are directly or indirectly affecting all of us. For example, outage of Facebook and Google which covers 95% of the internet which was left in dark. Data breaches, tracking users without their knowledge, manipulating users by using brands and political ads and many more. The biggest question is is this going to be changed in future? The answer is a little complicated. Yes and no. The current age of web is web 2.0, also known as participative or social web. There are two ages of the web. Web 1.0, which was between 1990 to 2004, where user can see a simple static website without any interactions. And after that, the age of web 2.0 started from 2002 and what we are currently browsing like Facebook, YouTube, Google, Instagram, Snapchat where we can interact, share, comments, share our thoughts. And in the coming days there will be web 3.0 which technology is used in cryptocurrencies which are encrypted and share info as per user's permission. Not like now where companies track users and extract information without user's knowledge. Or like some countries like China or North Korea does show their citizens what the government needs them to see and let me point you to one thing the web and the internet are two quite different things on one hand the internet is to send data from one device to another device via the socket as you can see in offices schools or even hospitals where they store files on one pc and can be accessed to other pcs using ftp or socket connections If I give you a better example like you use Android or iOS applications which can be Facebook, Netflix or Snapchat which are accessed without going to the web or opening any browsers and on the other hand web is to communicate and receive data in HTML, CSS etc like uh, www.google.com or www.wikipedia.com Now we have knowledge about what is the internet and web's version in this video we will cover whether web 3.0 will be better and safer as compared to web 2.0 which we are using right now so subscribe to my channel and let's start so the main question is will the tech giants let web 3.0 take over the internet i don't think so because it will cause them a loss of billions of dollars Think it like that Facebook cannot know what product you are browsing or from which location you are accessing the product and same goes with Google they cannot trace you so they don't know which ads are relevant to you Yes they can ask for permission like iOS 14 does in their app tracking transparency feature or they can make a paid version for users who didn't give access to read their personal data because none of the companies can function without money even websites who give you access to download free music movies images earn profit by showing you ads and then the internet will be break down into two parts people who cannot pay will be the product to earn profit and second for people who can pay can keep transparency on the internet even now users can totally keep their transparency by using a trusted vpn so even in the future With web 3.0 nothing will be different. Users have to pay to use a product or use their services for free and be a product. And right now whole internet keep you as their product by giving you a premium or free services and same goes with Facebook. Right now many charges have put against Facebook which are Facebook sells user personal data to other companies and Facebook is making their social network as a addictive drugs among teenagers and many more will congress put a stop on this or take a step to share every internal data with the government that's the story for some other video